Taylor Hearn will have to face. It'll be his sixth start of the season, 37th game overall. You can see him there with a three and four record. 71 punch out so far for this lefty in 70 and two thirds innings. His numbers are really good, and he strikes out Brantley. That is out number two. That's a big fastball from Taylor Hearn below the zone, something we don't see too often from Michael Brantley where he chases. But he had a decision to make and not a lot of time to do it at 96 miles an hour. I don't, not that I know of. I feel like I kind of copied him a little bit. <laughs> DJ to CJ to EJ. Good breaking ball there from long levered Taylor Hearn. Taylor's payoff pitch. That is strike three called. Another perfect inning for Taylor Hearn. That's four straight. He had one bump in the road last inning where he seemed to struggle to find the strike zone and he's bounced back so incredibly well. This is paint on the inside corner from Hearn. This is 2-2. Two -two. Swing and a miss. He strikes out Maldonado and the inning is done. Houston gets a couple back though. We're halfway there this afternoon. Rangers still lead it 5-2. I'm sure they've had to endure a, a number of blowout games as Jones strikes out swinging two away. Hearn at 84 pitches is 0 2. There's a swing and a miss. Strike three. A strikeout of Diaz. There are two away. Great 0 2 pitch here from Taylor Hearn. You get ahead of a right handed hitter and expanding the zone up and in. It's such a great place to go for swings and misses as long as you can get it there. And that is what Taylor Hearn did.